The first written record of Brandy's chateau dates back to 1304. It was originally built as a fortress by the Mackay Lovick nobility and stayed in the family's possession until 1420. Some of its Gothic elements from that time are still visible today, such as the decorative bay window and the northern wall. By the time King Ferdinand I of Habsburg, who later became Holy Roman Emperor, took over the building in 1547, it had undergone reconstruction and was transformed into a castle that became one of the most popular places of residence for the region's kings and emperors. From the time of the first Emperor Ferdinand I, Brandy's castle was very famous and people liked to come here to hunt. It was a typical summer and hunting seat as it was not far from Prague. Then, there are also some religious reasons, why it was popular. The second part of the town, Stara Boleslav, has the biggest Czech tradition of St. Václav or Wenceslas which is also very connected to the second biggest Christian tradition of the Palladium of the Czech lands. Throughout the centuries, the emperors were connected with both traditions because they were not only Austrian emperors and heads of the central European monarchy but they were also Czech kings. The castle's golden age is believed to have been in the late 16th and early 17th centuries, under the rule of Rudolf II, the Holy Roman Emperor and King of Bohemia, who made the chateau his primary residence outside of Prague. The period of the rule of Rudolf II was the most important and most famous time of Brandy's castle. He used the castle and the surrounding forests very often and at the time Brandy's was very nice. The garden was very famous and one of the best in Europe at the time. But then, in the time of the Thirty Years' War, Brandy's, its buildings and the garden, was destroyed. Now we only have a few authentic documents from the time of Rudolf II following the end of the Thirty Years' War. Emperor Charles VI continued to travel to Brandy's to hunt. On some occasions, he was accompanied by his daughter Maria Theresa.